up guys so we've been out for two days now we went hunting with sin city outdoors you guys will see that action was pretty slow but we still had a lot of fun i think we put three in the truck and a badger so that was that was cool called the badger right in it head butted the call um i think we're gonna cut cut it here and um start fresh tomorrow morning hopefully they'll start calling a little bit better and we'll be able to put a bunch on film again but we'll see thanks for watching guys we will see you tomorrow morning don't forget promo code coyote assassins at one rate 10 percent off thanks guys see ya Let him decoy just a second. Let me get solid. I'm coming over here. It's gonna go. Get off the other side. You ready? Woo! 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 Good? Yeah. Nice, dude. How was that for a shot? Were you on him? Yeah. Nice. Not tight, but it'll do. That was a headshot. Got the screen working. That was a little chaotic. I'd say. He was here. he was gonna decoy. Like he wanted to decoy. That was cool. All right. 
I'll run out there with Striker. He'll help me find him. I don't have to worry about that one being dead. He's done for. Alrighty. Another one bites the dust. Good meal. Good boy, Stryker. Good boy. Not a pop. I got a question for you guys. Put it down in the comments. No more. No more. No more. No more. No. 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 Um, what was it? Oh yeah. Question for you guys. I want to know. Before you guys go out coyote hunting, what is it that you guys look for in the weather, moon phase, like what do you have the best luck with? I understand if you don't want to tell me. I'm just curious if any of it like goes with what I think. So next time uh, on the next video I'll talk about what I what I think is the best. Thanks guys. See you on the next one. If you guys walk out to do a stand and you see one of these big shiny balloons sitting up right next or sitting in the weeds right next to where you're at, make sure and pick it up because if you don't, the coyote comes and it's gonna see it, it's gonna spook. I've had it happen to me a couple times. Plus it's good to pick up trash. I was thinking to myself, man, we should go just go over that hill so we can see better. We would have floored him. Yeah. Oh well. At least they're calling today. So we're coming up the bottom of this valley, and we had the wind was pretty good when we first started up it. Now we're clear down in the bottom of this valley, and the wind is not good. It's blowing the same direction we're going. So we're trying to call them from that way, but they keep coming from this way. And uh, had them ones coming, there was three of them coming good. And it smelled us and turned around to take off. And I shot, I don't know how how far, let's, let me range that real quick. How far is that? It looks like 400 yards. I either hit right over it or right below it, I'm not sure. I had to give it some wind too because the wind's blowing, like I said, that way. That coyote got right straight downwind of us and noped right out of there. But we'll make some corrections, keep after them, and put some more in the truck for you guys to watch. You guys want one of them black diamond scopes? I can hook you up with for a real good deal. All you gotta do is message me. Christmas time's coming. 
anybody get one of them for Christmas, they'd be one happy camper. I can promise you that. Hit me up, guys. That means that there, we're gonna have a good day. Yeah. Uh, first one of the day. Thanks for watching, guys. Um. Yeah. We'll go to the next one. <laughs> I don't think I would have made that shot if it wasn't for that sly dog chair. Holy crap. I had to like lean clear up on the back of it and like be halfway kneeled and halfway set and it was awkward, awkward position, but we got her made. That and the swagger. Go check them out guys. Thanks for watching. Yeah. Woo! Woo! Yeah, take it. I couldn't freaking, I had to rearrange my seat because I was falling over backwards. I rely too much on that thing. Goodness sakes. You know what I'm going to say, right? What? guys that sums it up we're done for the weekend I think we got six coyotes all together had a lot of fun met up with uh, Sin City Outdoors was able to do some hunting with them got three of the coyotes with them and then me and Eric got three coyotes today so thanks for watching we'll see you on the next our oh, wait yeah we was able to go do some hunting with Sin City Outdoors 
go check them out. They're, they do a lot of awesome stuff. They don't just coyote hunt. They do everything. Fishing, hunting, camping, cooking. Like, you name it, they do it. So, go check them out. Get, get subscribed to their channel. Uh, thanks again for watching. We really appreciate it. Make sure to like, share, subscribe, all of the above. Check us out on Instagram, Coyote Assassins, Facebook, whatever you want. We're even on TikTok now. So, also, if you guys want to get some of this camo, it's what I use. I've been using for years and years. It works great. It blends in like you wouldn't believe. If you guys decide you want some, use uh, promo code Coyote Assassins at OneRateGear.com. Thanks, guys. We see you next time. All right, guys, I know you can't see us very well. We're going to do another outro. Right after we got done talking with you guys and doing the outro for the last video, or today's video, we decided to do one more stand. Eric wanted to shoot a coyote. I was like, sweet, let's do it. We come up over this hill, started calling with the shelter belt. Or no, it was TNT, huh? Yeah. Probably got to level 15 on the sound. And all of a sudden, Eric's like, here comes two of them. They're hauling butt. And we got both of them. Well, we hit both of them. We found Eric's, or mine. We're not sure which one, but we couldn't find the other one. So that's that. So we got five coyotes today. Remember, guys, Coyote Assassins promo code for one rate gear. Get you 10% off. Later.